Okay, so this is part 6 of my 100% walkthrough on New Super Mario Bros. Wii. And uh, yeah, let's carry on. We completed the uh, first half of World 3 in the last episode. And we're going to be completing the other half in this episode. So let's get into the tower, because that is the next upcoming level. So um, again, I'm going to be getting all of the star coins since this is a 100% walkthrough. And sorry if you can hear vehicles outside, I've got my window open, I should probably close it, but I don't have time to do that anymore, so yeah, I'm kind of stuck with my window open, so yeah, sorry. But um, the first star coin is actually, well I'm going to get an ice flower first of all because that will come in handy, so how am I going to get to this, that's the real question. I'll just go up here, jump, and there you go. Got myself a flower. Oh, I just, I don't like these levels, they're really awkward. But anyways, let's go ahead and continue on with the level. Because what you want to do is basically run and jump through here. And you can go through the door. And get the first star coin, which is right here. So let's bounce off the wall. It's probably not even the easiest way to do it. But I guess you could just jump down and grab it. Like so. And there you go, that's the first star coin. So let's go ahead and get out of here. So we can get the second one. And the second one is actually really hard to get. So uh, yeah, you're going to need to step up your game right here. So uh, first of all, you want to make sure all of these dry bones are eliminated. Because you just don't want them hanging around when you're trying to get this star coin. Because they make it extremely awkward. But anyways, let's go ahead and get this halfway flag. And let's get a flower. There we go. Now this is when the level becomes really, really difficult. Uh, you basically just want to freeze all of these dry bones and just make sure they're all uh, eliminated and nowhere near you because, yeah, as I said, they pose a huge threat. But uh, what you want to do is pick up this power right here and you just want to keep jumping on their heads and just keep them away from you. There we go. But uh, to make this star coin easier, I would hold on to this pal, don't throw it. Because if you if you do so happen to drop it like I did just then, you kind of affect your chances again, the star coin. So yeah, it's now going to be a lot harder for me to get it. So, oh god. Stay away from these spiky balls because they are bad. They are very bad, and as you can see, there's more of them coming up, so, yeah. But they do get rid of the dry bones, which is, I guess, good. But I lost my flower, so now I'm sad. And anyways, you want to go over here, and you basically want to let the balls uh, break all the blocks, and then you can get rid of it, like so. And then you can get the star coin, and continue on with the level. But anyways, let's go ahead and bounce up here. Yeah, this is pretty awkward, this level, I'm not going to lie. But anyways, the last star coin is right there. You basically want to bounce off the wall and get it. And there you go. Let's get rid of him. And let's see if there's uh, a hidden block somewhere. No hidden block? Whatever, we're going to have to take on Lemmy without a flower. Not that I need one anyway. I guess it just makes me survive longer. But anyways, let's take on Lemmy Cooper. Shouldn't be too hard. I say that and then I just die. Come on, you're going down. Yeah. I'm gonna kill him as fast as possible. Come on, dude. Let's go. Oh god. Alright, there we go. That's Lemmy Cooper. <laughs> Pretty easy, to be honest. But yeah, uh, we're now going to be moving on to the next upcoming levels in World 3, getting all of the Star Coins. And I hope you all have uh, been enjoying the series. But there you go, he's hopping away. Awesome. That cannon is so tempting. Nope, I don't care, Toad. I don't care. Alright, let's go. 
Oh, yep, we want to save our game, of course. There we go. Let's go up here. Alright. Now, this level is pretty freaking hard, because the first exit you want to get is, of course, the second exit. So, um, yeah, you're going to need to get the second exit on this one if you want to unlock the World 3 100%. So, yeah, this is a pretty hard level. Just thought I'd point that out, because it is pretty tricky. But uh, the first star coin is located right there. You can get rid of this guy by just jumping and throwing a nice thing at him. And you can take care of him like that. And there's the first star coin. But anyways, let's go ahead and continue. And as you can see, there are these uh, invisible block things right here. There's like the lining of it. Uh, basically, uh, there's a button you can press in this world. And it will basically reveal those blocks so you can get a certain exit. But um, you need to complete the level first. So, yeah, I'm having trouble getting up here. This is annoying. Can I just bounce off the wall? Yeah. That makes it a lot easier. I like this music. Alright, we want to stay away from these Koopas because they're obviously very annoying and of course one of them just like made me lose my mushroom, silly goon. Alright, so the second star coin is right here. And there you go, let's get the halfway flag. And here's a bunch of Goombas. But let's go ahead and get the um, penguin suit. I guess it will come in handy. I hate this level so much. <laughs> oh god. Uh, oh god. This is really, really, really scary. Oh. Hello. Oh god. I need to go back because there's a tall iceberg thing there and uh, you can't actually jump over that. So if that one comes along then you're basically screwed. Unless you jump on top of it, of course. Oh, really? Get out of here. Oh god. Okay, we're gonna have to go back. Unless we jump over it like that. This guy is gonna be very annoying. But the last star coin is located right here. There we go. But let's go ahead and get rid of him, I guess. And that didn't even do anything. That just released a bunch of coins. <laughs> Which I couldn't grab, because... Yeah. But anyways, here's the second exit. The first exit actually takes you to the castle, but... Yeah, it's going to take you to another level which you need to complete. And you can't even get all of the star coins on this level yet, so... Yeah. Alright. Now let's go ahead and... Jump into this level right here. And this level's not too bad. You complete it pretty fast. You can only get the first star coin to start off with, you have to wait to uh, reveal the um, red blocks, but yep, first star coin is pretty close, you just want to keep jumping on this thing right here, but yeah, just be patient and you'll see the first star coin, just hold on to this flying thing and you'll be good. Uh, it's somewhere to the right I think, I can't fully remember where this star coin is. Having trouble remembering. Oh, there it is. Alright, so you basically just want to go up like that. And that's the first star coin. And you can't get the rest of them yet, you have to get the red box first. So we're going to have to complete this level, and then we can get the star coins. And we're also going to have to complete the other level again, so we can go to the castle. But yep. Yeah. I really like this level, it's so much fun. Oh god, this is getting pretty hard. Uh, I guess I could throw this thing down now. Okay, that was silly. But then again, I am a silly person. But yep, yeah, you have to go in this pipe right here. There is another pipe where you can get the rest of the star coins, but I can't get it yet. Yeah, let's go ahead and finish this. There we go. Now, we only got one star coin, of course, because we can't get the other two yet. And we're nine minutes into the recording. I reckon I could squeeze in the castle. Just for your guys' entertainment. Then again, actually no, I'll save the castle for the next part. But you want to hit this button right here. And it's going to uh, make... It's going to reveal the red blocks. 
Now I'm going to use a mushroom because we want to jump back into this level and get the star coins. I know it's frustrating, but yeah, you just want to get them out of the way. Alright, there we go. I guess we could get a uh, propeller suit out of here. There we go. That's going to help us out a lot. There we go. I love the music to this level. Like, seriously, I love it so much. These red blocks aren't even that helpful. <laughs> like, seriously, I don't even need them. I just need my propeller suit and I'm all good. But yeah, just stay on top of this block and you're good. I've now realised how long it's taken for me to put out a Mario episode. I'm, I'm sorry, I really do apologise. I know it's taken a while. I'm sorry. Alright, there we go. Hopefully this music isn't echoing. Because if it is, then again, I'm sorry. I'm sorry for failing you all. Oh god. This is scary. This is really scary. I'm tempted to look at the recording thing to see if I'm still recording, but uh, I'll probably die, so I don't really want to do that. But what you want to do is basically go on these red blocks, then go through this pipe, and then you can continue on with the level and get the rest of the star coins. Now I'm not sure where the second one is actually, I can't, can't remember. That's bad of me to forget. And as you can see it's going a bit faster, this thing. Which is a bit scarer. I probably should have... Wait, I think it's here. Yeah, there it is. Oh god. Stop scaring me like this game. Alright, let's quickly get this star coin. Get out of here, Koopa. No, I don't want to pick that up! Okay, that was close. Silly Mario picking up an ice thing. What's he doing? That was close. I almost died. I was so close to dying just then. <laughs> yeah. Alright. There we go, that's the last star coin. Oh, really? Stupid Coopers. Oh no. Oh no. Uh, stay away from me. Uh, there we go, we can finish the level now. Let's get out of here, this is dangerous. Dangerous territory. Alright. Awesome. Oh my god, I almost died again. <laughs> oh my god. That was bad. Okay, there we go, that's the level done. Now we need to jump back into the other one again. And uh, just get the first exit. And we've unlocked a star shop. Not that I really care, because they're a bit silly, and I don't really care about them. Because stars are useless in this game, I don't even use them that much. Don't enjoy using them, frankly. But anyways, let's go ahead and... Uh, use these red blocks to our advantage and finish this level. Uh, you can basically just rush through it once you have all the, uh, oh god, not him. Not him. You know what, I'm gonna take it the safe side and just go on this thing right here. Oh wait, I think I have to go through there. Actually, no, I don't have to. It doesn't matter. Alright, so I think we can just, you know, finish this level quickly. Which shouldn't be too hard. Just need to try and remember where these uh, red blocks go to. Because it takes you to the first exit. I can't quite remember. Oh god. Yeah, I can't quite remember where they are. Where it is, sorry, the um the exit. Oh god. I think it's there. Alright. Let's go down here quick before we die. Alright, yeah, basically takes you to this warp pipe right here. And you can finish the level. Like so. Yeah, it takes you underground. And you just gotta put up with all these Goombas. I guess I could pick up one of these things. And just eliminate them on the way. Maybe get a 1-up. Oh, no, of course I didn't. <laughs> Alright, let's finish this level. Because it's starting to really scare me now. Uh, there we go. And uh, can we squeeze in the castle? I think we can. Just for you guys, that's how much I love you. I'm going to squeeze in the castle. I'm going to do the castle because the castle is amazing. Although I do want to save it for a special episode.